This is a how-to video on how to map your Photon MIDI fader with DJ Player Pro manually. First thing you want to do is make sure that your USB cable is plugged in and also plugged into your iPad via camera connector. Next thing you want to do is go ahead and open up DJ Player Pro. Once open, you're going to go and hit the gear icon above the fader. When open, going to go ahead and hit the MIDI to the far right and then make sure that the USB and virtual device is Photon. If that's good to go, go ahead and move the fader back and forth and make sure you're getting MIDI data. Now go ahead and press the Photon map right below USB virtual devices and then go ahead and press it again. Now you're going to go ahead and scroll down and keep going until you see main mixer controls. Once you get there after FX3, you're going to go ahead and see the crossfader button. Press that and then go ahead and scroll down to input 1. Hit learn. Move the fader back and forth when you get MIDI data. Then hit apply. And then go ahead and move the fader back and forth and now you'll see it moving the software. Go ahead and hit the little floppy looking icon in blue next to the clear and that will save the presets. For calibrations, use the screwdriver provided. And we're going to go ahead and put that in the right side and then go ahead and move it to the right until we see the fader move to the center. And then we back it off back to the left until we see it go back to the side. Now by doing this, we can go ahead and set the cut in. The further over to the left you go, the wider the cut in is going to be on the fader. But if you want it super fine, just go ahead and move it over. And then as soon as it goes back, you barely move it and it does move. That's for super sharp, but we want to go ahead and make it a little bit wider. So we're going to go ahead and move it back to the left a little bit. Now we're going to go ahead and start adjusting the other side. Move the fader back over to the left. And then with the left trimmer on that side, go ahead and do the same. Move it to the right until it goes to the middle. Once it goes to the middle, then we back it off back to the left. And set your cut point. Now that's super sharp, we're just going to go ahead and now make it a little bit wider so we get a little bit, a little more space. So that's how you adjust and set the cut in on your Photon Fader with DJ Player Pro. Thank you for watching.